Good afternoon. Oh, where do we start? Where do we start? Sit down first. Oh, it's better. It's better. Oh, I've been busy. As you can see at the back of me here, this is what I've been busy with the companion set. Very large companion set. So, um, Busy putting that together. And it's worked reasonably well. Um, I started with pokers, believe it or not. I started with a visit to buy antler, which I did there. That not long after that last video. Popped in and seen Chris and uh, ended up buying the antler off him. Which is the three, cut, the three sheds which uh, I bought also with this, which is hanging from the ceiling here. Um, this is a, it's a one-off job, a young stag uh, taken out. It's been a short job. Um, don't know the reasons for it, but there would be good reasons for it being taken out. Uh, but it's, it was on a building. And it was bleached, to say the least. <laughs> I'm going to have to take half the skull away um, and mount it. Uh, that's another little journey to get a nice bit of wood to, to mount it on. But I'm busy bringing the, the antler back to colour. Uh, as you can see, it's come along quite nicely. It's had... Uh, it's... <laughs> when they brought it out to show me, it had a... Somebody had told them. Boot polish. <laughs> brown boot polish. So believe it or not, it had a go with brown boot polish. I went, oh, dear, dear, dear. Uh, no, no, no. You maybe get away with touching up a little bit of something on it, say on a, an antler, but certainly not the whole thing. That's had two coats, wire brushed, and two coats of uh, potassium permanganate on it. Uh, and it's coming back quite nicely. Um, the wire wool will go on it now a little bit just to pick out highlights on it and uh, and then I'll get one final coat uh, back to the crowns and then we'll do the skull later. But. Uh, I'm quite pleased with it. It's it's, it's, good. it's, it's a lot. It's a nice pair. It's very nice, um, and it'll look good. Something else to be going on with. But the shed antler I got it was very nice. As I say, I've cut it up all one into bits and pieces and whatnot. You just got to decide what you're going to go with and uh, chop it. It never lends itself totally to what you would like out of it. Uh, that's for sure. It never does that at all. Um, and so you've just got to take the saw and go for it. Uh, I've not, I normally use a small circular saw, I've got a bench saw, but there's not enough to uh, warrant bringing that out, so I'm probably safer if I just do with the hand saw. Even then, it's, it can be risky, like you know. Um, but so we've chopped it up anyway, and there's going to be. Uh, those two parts are going to be uh, priests, since uh, the other ones went away and highly worked really, really well. Um, there's two short pieces of uh, that will be turned into priests. Uh, they work really nice. And one of them's going for uh, a little going away present for my favourite. Sea fisherman, Stephen, who uh, had lost his mojo there for a little while, I think, and uh, but he's now got it back. Uh, and I arrived back home there the other week there to find uh, he had dropped off uh, some cod and some haddock. What can you say? <sighs> beautiful, absolutely beautiful. It's a shame that uh, the all fish does not come the same way, but 
fresh, of course. I mean, it doesn't get any fresh. Um, stuff that comes in with the trawlers, I'm afraid it's been sitting on ice for quite a while before it makes it back. Uh, but Stephen, anyway, glorious it was, beautiful. But the companion set it started with poker. <laughs> I was using, when I was visiting Chris, <laughs> this handler, by the way, I bought off his wife. I bought that one off him and I bought that off his wife. Um, and the price was, was good, good enough for me to buy it, so I went right, fair enough. And, uh, but when I was busy, when I was there, he had showed me poker they had made up with a bit of handler on it and whatnot and that. And this is a straight poker, which is, the straight poker's a, a made up one for the, the companion set, but it doesn't have handler on it as such, but these ones do. Uh, and I was looking for means for to use up all the odds and ends of crowns and biggest bits of crowns and other things I've got left in the box that don't really lend themselves to sticks that are too big um, and odd shapes and whatnot. So we ended up putting them into a uh, pocket. I had the metal line out there, so which I brought in and uh, hit up and put a bend on it and. Uh, Yep, so works quite nice. Uh, I used up some of the, uh, the odds and sods that uh, I had there, and uh, that was that. Some of the roll, let's say roll handler too. It's the way of using it all, all things up, so, um, but. Uh, Busy, busy, I've been for a while, but uh, it's quite good because I'm not doing as much walking now. I'm afraid. Let me cut back on that. At some point or other, maybe get round to take the blood off me. Oh, I've got that. the noise that you hear is uh, Alec next door and extending the beer garden for the pub and whatnot, like and all. Man, it's a weird business now. The pub works with an app on the phone. If you want to order a drink, uh, buy a drink, you've got to download this app. Which you tell me all about it. I mean, I'm quite fortunate. The barmaid was there. She's got one of these full lasers things on the front. It's a weird business getting used to it nowadays. Uh, so many people running about, driving about, walking about with masks. Um, <laughs> will I ever get used to it? I don't really know. Maybe seen the best of things, and that's it. Anyway, uh, that's what we've been busy with. But this one I will spend quite a bit of time on. It'll be a like any longish project. This one, but once it's mounted, it'll be. I know a lot of people don't really like this kind of thing nowadays. I get people coming in for sticks who don't like the antler at all. Even shed antler, they won't. Anyway, they certainly don't like the stuff that's been shown. <laughs> Oh dear, 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 dear. Um, but like all things, it needs to be. There's a certain amount of money been put on. That's it. So, must have been something wrong with this beastie when it was taken out. Uh, as young as it was, so that's it. But anyway, I think that's it. Where we are, I don't know, time wise, no idea. My timer stopped working. I think it stopped working now. It's, uh, so I'm kind of guessing that hopefully we're on, we're on time with this as such, like, you know. Um, and we'll crack on a little bit and do what we need to do. Keep busy, keep busy. But I hope all things are well with you. And uh, these are, are difficult times and difficult for us getting used to. I think. And I can only imagine how difficult it must be for young people uh, to take all this on board now and whatnot. But there you go. Anyway, I hope that's been of interest. Um, and we'll catch you again. Cheers. Yeah.